recently, me and my friend George here uh, set up two canvases back to back along Kingston Riverside, uh, where we painted all day long and let loose on the canvas. We chose Kingston because, uh, well, it's our home, really. Uh, we're fond of the area, so I take a lot of inspiration. great was that we chose a location where people were actually going to stay put, socialise um, and dine with each other and that's the beauty of where we were this time because last year uh, people were noticing and were a part of it but they actually walked past it quite a lot whereas this time they actually stayed put and saw it from start to finish. I don't plan my art. The whole process is the art. The end result is, uh, is a byproduct of the process. I take inspiration from around me, uh, especially that morning. Um, it's just look looking down into the river, the greens and the blues, they just instantly, I just sort of had an idea of what I was going for. My process is completely different to Brad's. Yeah, but I think that's the good thing about this event and why you got involved, because we're, we're two completely different artists. Yeah, we still use a canvas and oil paint, but we're just completely opposite ends. I plan and uh, it's all about how the painting starts to take shape and take form um, and then becomes the end result, whereas yours is constantly the end result. You can stop any minute and it could be the finished piece. It's true, and images can arise from every stroke that I do. Mm -hmm. I mean, anything can happen. So for me, I mean, this is the second time that I've painted live in the town. I mean, but this is your first. What have you gained or learned from this experience? Oh, I thought it was great. I mean, I, I gained some real sort of raw feedback that you wouldn't necessarily find in a gallery. It's all about you. Uh, I just love the whole experience, really, being there and you haven't, you've got a canvas in front of you, and it's just that point, just before you're about to start, the, the feeling of you can do no wrong. No matter what goes on the canvas, nothing is going to ruin the painting. Mm. Um, and I just love as well just being kind of anxious being watched and, and that, that, that feeling of feeling vulnerable, um, I kind of use that to channel into the paintings. Calling out your name